people welcome to my new vlog so today I'm just going to take my G1 test G1 driver test and uh, by the way this is channel about health workout and life yeah and today it's uh, some short vlog about my life and I'm getting G1 test and actually it's service Centario behind me and frankly I'm not going to take right now this test because I just passed it maybe like 10 minutes ago and of course I was failed uh, guys uh, sorry, I'm kidding again. I'm not failed. Of course, I'm passed. Uh, it was my first try, and I, I passed my exam, so it's okay. I just got some temporary driver license. In three months, I will get my uh, G1 driver license. And yeah, this is the center behind me. All this uh, stuff took me around one hour. This service center opened it. One hour ago and now 8 a.m. and now I am past this exam. I was here around 6:30 and it's already uh, some people in front of me. It was actually some three guys. So yeah, guys, it's pretty important for me today. I'm new camera and of course it's important day for everyone to get in this first level driver license G1. Then I have to get G2 and of course full license G. And some some kind of special conditions. Uh, I can get my G license because of because of I am already driver at my home country. I, I got my driver license at my home country. That's why I can get full G in shortest time as possible. So you yeah, guys stay tuned. I will tell you some. I will give you some tips how to pass this exam, and I will left some useful links uh, under this video in the comment section below. You can find some cool links to some sources to where you can get some information to be ready to pass this exam with first with your first try okay guys hey friends take a look to this wall behind me it's so cool isn't it I don't know what this kind of place here. It's uh, service Ontario behind me, this way. And this wall you can find here, this wall. Okay, friends, let me give you some advice about how to pass this G1 test, yeah? First of all, uh, don't be rushed when you're going to pass your G1 test. You don't have any time frame, you know? And you can take some time, just take your time and you will pass, I'm sure. Uh, sometimes the question is tricky. You have to read carefully and it's important for you just don't be rushed please and yeah uh, i just checked my uber and i i was here around 6 6 20 today so yeah maybe that's why it, it was so uh, small amount of people this morning it was only like three guys and yeah it's i was lucky enough to to be uh, so close to the this line started yeah so yeah, and th uh, after this, and by the way, after this exam, I didn't saw a lot of people inside of this building. It's maybe it was maybe around 40, maybe people's 40 or 50. Uh, not not like 100, you know. Like uh, I read some in comment section on Google Google reviews about passing this exam. So yeah, it, it wasn't a lot of people. It was pretty kind and it's a good place i, I left uh, a link to this service ontario to this driver test or you can just google it just uh, write uh, driver driving test on your google maps and you will find the closest one to your house to your condo i don't know where you're gonna live so uh, i just uh, this one is works well for me there's a lot of windows 
where beautiful lady is sitting and you can pass your uh, vision check then you're going to show your proof of your residence and then you have to show your ID, your driver license if you have. In my case, I've got some Ukrainian driver license. So that's that's why I have some special condition and I have I can get my full G faster. Yeah. Hey folks, I just want to find some subway station. I'm not going to take Uber because it cost me around $40. <laughs> not so pretty cheap so yeah and uh, right now i'm just going to uh, grab my sandwich i already have one in my backpack oh yeah guys just take a look at this this is girls it's cool yeah isn't it and yeah guys this should be north york neighborhood if i'm not wrong So yeah, my day started at 5 a.m. and it's just insane for me. It's November 10. Just to mention here, yeah, for the history. And tomorrow is going to be November 11, and it's Remembrance Day. In, Remembrance Day in Canada. It's extremely important holiday to remember what our grandpas did for us. Yeah, I, I don't have any relatives in Canada, but general we have to remember about this uh, about world war one about world war two it's extremely important to remember about this because it's happened sometimes in this in nowadays and of course you guys you know uh, what we're talking about so yeah it's extremely important date and it's going to be long weekend and i will make some plugin maybe so yeah stay tuned guys and Give me a thumbs up if you like it, this video. Hey friends, let me give you some more tips here. Just uh, I would advise you to take some rest before taking the exam, maybe at least two days. And it should work well for you. And one more thing I should mention here. If you will pass with the first try, with your driving, with the writing, the driving test, if you will uh, fail, just retake this exam immediately. I mean, you can you can retake this day exactly this day. I don't know, maybe you have to wait sometimes to retake this exam, but you can do it exactly this day, and it should work well for you. You can do it twice or thrice. I don't know how many times you want. You can take it, retake it one more time and one more time. So yeah, this is good advice for you. I didn't know about this before. Just some uh, Uber drivers told me about this and yeah just uh, i would advise you to as soon as possible arrive to your driving uh, local test uh, lo local center service ontario so real friends maybe it will some kind of short vlog and i hope you enjoy this one i hope you find some useful information and you will find some handy links under this video in the comment section below and yeah guys that's it for today i'll see you soon in the next one and peace and just remember guys you can all bye